I'm the owner, and my name is Harry. I opened my first shop when no. I was 21 years old, and then I started this barbering vibe in 2013. So I started doing lots of beards and bearded influencers and all this kind of stuff. So we opened a small shop, just two chairs in Soho in 2015. Yeah. Uh, and then that kind of grew to where we are now into 2,000 square feet, big space, basement, parties, events, trainers, coffee. Um, because it just went naturally. So we took chairs, we grew it, barbering got bigger and bigger. I like to drink alcohol as you know, <laughs> from around 1 o'clock till about 1 o'clock. <laughs> so, I had my own bar, and then my own bar went to my friends chilling at the bar, and then people hiring the bar, and then doing uh, birthday parties and stag dudes. We had Netflix hire the shop. There's a series called Giri Haji. You look at Giri Haji, you'll see two, three episodes filmed in my shop. Try to come and shoot someone in the shop. Yeah. So very interesting. David Beckham, House 99. We've done some commercials with him through the shop. So it's got into more of a lifestyle thing. So now we've got this place, we've only been here five weeks, so we're still doing little bits of work, the lounge is not open. Uh, and as you've seen, we've got graffiti artists from America coming here doing a little splash on my wall, you know? That's basically the plan, it's just easy going, a little bit more casual, you've seen the clients, you've seen the vibe. Nothing's very official, nothing's really official. So basically here, you can come here, you can have a coffee, right? You can have a snack, you can buy a pair of trainers, you can get your hair cut, you can have your beard trim, you can buy my own products that I make here in the UK, my beard bar. We have recording studios downstairs, we have a podcast studio, we have people that teach you how to do podcast videos through the podcast and we're about to open the members club. The members club will open hopefully in about a month and then there will be for members to come work, space, private events, we will be hosting things every month, so every month we'll do a tequila night, a special trainer night, cigar night, right? and our members will buy a ticket, car and, and spend the night with us. So they're all the kind of things you can do. Uh, my name's Gail Porter, I'm from Edinburgh, as you can maybe tell. Anyway, um, I've lived in Soho for, I lived in Soho for about seven years, I've lived in London for 26 years, um, I'm 51 years of age. My relationship with Harry is that um, I walked past his shop one day and I went in, obviously not for a haircut because I've got alopecia, but um, it's just a nice place to hang out. And it's not like a, a barber's, it's like you come in and you can have a coffee, you can have a glass of wine, you can go downstairs and see what they're doing in the studio downstairs. And I think that's what's the great thing about Soho and the great thing about Harry and everybody that works here is that it's like a little miniature hairy club. It's just nice, it's that kind of like eclectic mix of Soho in a hairdresser. So I do think it's actually the, the guys that are in here are working here and they're bringing in the right kind of people because it's just got the right vibe and it's happy. It's the energy and it's got great energy and that's due to Harry and his team. I never plan that. I just do what I do and I let people fit around me. If I don't like them, these guys will tell me I don't let them in my shop. My brand is not for everybody. It's not for everybody. We're not trying to like franchise this shit out, you know what I mean? We're just doing our thing, getting by, touch wood, I get my boat in five years and get the fuck out. <laughs> Over and out, right?